This is Trip, and welcome to my channel. I'll tell you the stupid thing I did in just a minute. But anyway, first of all, I want to thank you for watching and for subscribing. And I've gotten more subscribers lately, and, and I really appreciate that. Now feel free to comment at the end of the video if you've tried one of these Subway Naturally Pit Smoked Brisket Sandwiches. You might even like the video and you might even decide to subscribe. But I want to know really, have you, have you tried one of these? And I'll tell you the stupid thing that happened, okay? I started making I already had half of the sandwich. I always cut the sandwiches in half because I know I'm not going to finish a whole one. And I like to show the viewers the inside, like a cross section of the sandwich. So anyway, I thought the video was running earlier and it turned out that it was, but for some reason I didn't think it was. So I got nearly to the end of it and turned it off and then realized that it was actually running. So I kind of messed, messed it up and I had to, start all, had to start all over again. Okay, this is the first time that has ever happened in all the videos that I've been making. I mean, all the food type, review type videos. So like I said, we're starting again. This is the Subway, Subway Naturally Pit Smoked Brisket. And I already had half of it, and I can tell you this is really good. I don't want to get too cold, so... Okay, the price of this thing was about... was, uh, was um, four, no, five dollars, eighty-nine cents. That for a six inch. So the twelve inch was... was about... I guess it would have been... about ten dollars something like that but if you it, you're, it's more economical to buy the 12 inch than the 6 inch just cut it in half and have the other half later because if one if one sandwich costs almost costs almost six dollars and but the bigger sandwich the 12 inch costs ten dollars and that means two of the smaller sandwiches would be $12. So you're better off getting the 12-inch the soap. Anyway, let's start off with this again. This is the... This is half of a brisket sandwich from Subway. In other words, this would be like a... Half of the 6-inch would be 3-inch. And here, there you are. You can see the meat here, the brisket. It's kind of like bacon. I'm going to show you that. It reminds me of like, like big bacon slices. Now, two pieces of two pieces of of um, smoked cheddar cheese go on each on each one of these six inches. The six inch sandwich has three ounces of, of smoked, uh, of the smoked brisket, and two slices of the smoked cheddar cheese. So you just double that for the, for the foot long. The, the 12 inch has then like, like six ounces of, of brisket and, and four slices of the, of the cheese. And the cheese is kind of shaped in a triangle. I don't normally get cheese on anything if you've been watching my videos. I did in this case. And I'm glad I did. But you can't see the cheese now because when she cooked it, she melted it down for me. And you can have other things on here too. I had, I asked her to put onions on it. And you can't see those. You can see them a little bit. I don't know if you can hear or not. And the, and the uh, lettuce. And that's all I added to it. You know, I don't like cheese very much on sandwiches because to me it's a cop-out 
because every you know all these fast food places put cheese on everything just about wherever they can find a place to put it they'll put some cheese on it and I asked her just to put light sauce so she made like two strips which I'd have been happy with just one but finally when I got it home and I was trying that first one the first half it was really good I mean the sauce was really good let's get into it now Subway naturally pit smoked brisket sandwich take two Just like I said in the first video that I that I deleted that went bad. This is really there's the smoke. You can taste this the, the smoky flavor. I don't know if it's so much in the smoky cheddar cheese, if it's in the in the uh, the sauce, or if it's in the brisket. Of course, you know it's in the brisket and the sauce. some of this lettuce back in there. The lettuce is very, very crisp and fresh. The subway is very proactive in, in coming out with new, with new items bringing some back. I think this might be a limited time offer. But you should try to, you should pick up one of these I did such a dumb thing with that first video. And it was so good. Subway says about it. I'll read it right here in my notes. Brisket that's naturally slow smoked for at least 13 hours, topped with smoked cheddar cheese and zesty barbecue sauce. Our pit smoked brisket sandwich packs layer after layer of delicious smoky flavor on our signature Italian bread. And I wanted the nine grain bread, the whole grain, that's what I got here. Did I mention this before? I might have already confused it with the first video. Stop me if I did. The six inch sub has three ounces of, of slow of the brisket and two ounces of the smoked cheddar cheese. Whereas the 12 inch has six ounces of the brisket and four slices of the cheddar cheese.
this subway is near a major road and usually you have to be kind of careful about stopping at places along major roads and interstates and things like that because a lot of people are all just passing through and the quality of the food may not be as good but this place is really pretty good and I guess it's because of when I did a review for the subway sliders I went in there and it was the same kind of older lady and I say that with the knowledge now that she's actually younger than I. I thought she was maybe like 70 or maybe 75. She looked like a really grandmotherly type. And I asked when she was going to retire, because I had already retired, albeit after a car crash, she told me that she's going to retire in two or three years when she's 65. So she was actually 62 or 63. And I thought all that time that she was someone, that she was older than me. It turned out she was actually younger. So she wants to wait until she's 65 so she can draw what they call a Medicare in the United States. I know some of you are in foreign countries. Medicare covers uh, health care after you become 65. It doesn't cover everything like some people think, but it, it covers the, ma the main things. This is all very, the onions, the, the lettuce, all very good. The, the brisket has does have a, a very nice, but not overpowering smoky flavor. Sorry, I apologize if I repeat things from time to time. It might be an aging thing. I don't know. Oh, by the way, I'm, I'm sorry if I repeat things from time to time. It, it might be an aging thing. I don't know. They're just delicious. Subway is so innovative. I told you about the price, right? Yeah. are so tasty. And I asked for red onions. I got red onions. I like those better than the than the any other onion. 
That was truly a good sandwich. I enjoyed it. I like using my nice china plates. But I'm thinking about switching to a paper plate because sometimes whenever I'm, I'm cutting like this, it makes a bit of a sound. I don't, don't like to do that. But anyway, this is Trip, and I'm going to conclude this thing right now. And again, thank you all for, for watching this video and you know, all my other videos that you watch. I hope you have such a, a good day. The weather's actually a little bit nicer here. It's not so hot. It's been a very hot summer, the warmest on record, actually. So I wish you all the very best, a, a good week, and be safe. And I'll talk to you later.